Kirby, its comic book characters a goal. We could do better. We want to do better. Our spotlight today falls on the people who nibble at the edges of the entertainment world, like the rather surprising English group called The Clash. Also in that category is a man named Jack Kirby. He's the guy to blame if your kids or yourself seem to have an unnatural longing to turn on the TV set on a Saturday morning and join the company of some superheroes. Catherine Mann reports. How many characters have you created? It would probably... It would probably come to an army division. By his own admission, Jack Kirby's superhero creations are so numerous even he can't keep track. After some 40 years at the drawing board and an estimated 40,000 pages of action with such characters as Captain America, Fantastic Four, and the Avengers, Kirby is the undisputed king of comic book superheroes. What do your characters represent? Well, the characters represent uh, a sort of a, a transcendent feeling that we, we all have inside us that uh, uh, we could do better, we want to do better, uh, we have not time to do better, that uh, we can be the people that we lionize. To anyone passing by his Southern California home, Jack looks like anything but a muscle-bound superhero. But according to him, it's what's inside the mind that counts. If you look at my characters, you'll find me. No matter what kind of character you create or assume, a little of yourself must remain there. During the afternoon we spent with him, Jack couldn't resist including me in one of his action-packed plots. Uh, that's me being thrown from a helicopter by two vicious villains. But in the nick of time, I'm saved by a flying passerby. Oh, you're endowing me nicely there, Jack. Thanks a lot. <laughs> This is a Catherine Mann you've never seen before and probably never will again. This is my normal masculine instinct. <laughs> As he sits each day at his board, alone with his characters, Jack Kirby is far from lonely. I haven't got the trappings of a circus, but uh, there in my mind is a very active and bright and colorful place that's as good as any circus that I've ever seen. And uh, I live with that, and I enjoy it immensely. And that was of the new Catherine Mann, huh? Well, now we're going to move from the weird world to the real world.